What's up guys? Today we are starting The Rise of the Planet of the Apes. So, someone suggested this movie in my comments and I've always known this series existed, just never really thought to start it, I guess. But I guess now is my chance to. And on the poster, I'm pretty sure that I saw James Franco in this. And the last thing that I know he was in was Spring Breakers from a long time ago. <laughs> but I don't really know much about this movie series, mostly that it's just about apes and shit. I don't know. I just know they have those in it and people. I don't know. But I'm ready to see what this shit is about, so I guess let's get into it. Why did that dude remind me of Usher? I think I was tripping. So that one's the one that's caught while all of its friends and family didn't get caught. Imagine how traumatic that is. Hey, let's go again. Which one's this, number nine? Yeah, uh, uh, this is number nine. Bright eyes for color. How many moves was that? 20. The, the perfect score is 15. Doc, what are you, what are you giving her? Hey, give me that video! And they were so surprised that it was doing it that quickly. I always thought that they were some kind of smart. I've been working on this for five and a half years. The data is clear. We're ready, Stephen. All I need is your approval for human trials. Well, for this, you're gonna need the bullet. Why do you need human trials? What is it for? You got it. And Will? Yeah. Keep your personal emotions out of it. These people invest in results, not dreams. Okay. Do people ever really keep their emotions out of anything? In biology, this is called neurogenesis. Neurogenesis. We call it the cure to Alzheimer's. So he's trying to cure Alzheimer's? Does he have a family member that has it? Okay then, I was really scared that something would have happened. That's for you. That's for you. Why were they moving her like that? There have been absolutely no side effects associated with 112. With so while all of that is happening back at the lab, this man's still having his presentation. How are they going to find out that, like, whatever's happening at the lab right now? Profits, which is why we are confident that you will vote to approve human trials. So that's how they find out. It breaks into the middle of the thing. Jacobs. So they had to kill it. That is sad, but then if you think about it, it did go on a rampage, but it's in captivity. It's scared. I run a business, not a petting zoo. Find the most cost effective way to put those apes down. I can't do that. You're the chimp handler. Handle it. All of them, but why? Just because of that one mishap? Go back to the drawing board on the 112. Start again in molecular development. Find a way to get there before someone else does. I'll clean up this mess. It would suck to definitely have to go back from the start just because of one mishap. Like, they carry small. 
She must have been pregnant when we brought her in. So that's why. She wasn't being aggressive, she was just being protective. Oh my god. And no one knew. So then are they gonna keep it himself and possibly use it again without anyone else knowing? Let me tell you what, Doc. Jacob's made me put down the other 12. I'm done. Be my guest. And you try and put down a baby ape. See how you feel. What are you doing? Uh, well, he has good days and bad days. Mm -hmm. Today, not so good. Although he has been quoting Shakespeare. <laughs> oh. I guess they're talking about his dad. That's the dude from Pitch Perfect 3. He played Fat Amy's dad. Want to see something? What? Dad's gonna want to keep him. And you know what? Even though they killed the mom, they did tests on her and they didn't even know she was pregnant. So what if like that kind of stuff passed over to the baby, and bam. <laughs> this all they get his finger! That is so cute. How old is he? Like, a day old? Two days old? He can already drink on his own. What are you gonna name him? Once you name a pet, well, once you name it, you're gonna get attached to it. So. Right away, Caesar displayed signs of heightened intelligence. So I kept him. And they kept him for three years. Okay then. By age two, Caesar was completing puzzles and models designed for children eight years. He got his own room and everything. That's fucking wild. Dad? I don't need you right I can't do this anymore. He belongs in a home. This is no way for him to live. What happened to his mom, though? Maybe the mom's at work? Was he already gonna test it at home or like on his dad already? I don't know why I thought he was about to test it on himself for a second because I didn't know his dad was there. I really hope that something ends up working because that's going to be traumatic if it doesn't. Don't tell me this is going to be one of the things where it's like he's really good for a second and then the next thing you know he crashes hard from it not working or something. I'll, I'll need to keep track of what I take from the lab. Don't tell me that the, that it went out the window. Now, if I can sneak through I will. I'm not sick anymore. It's nothing to Caesar. I really hope that's the case. I hope he's not actually sick. Caesar! He can't have gone far. Caesar! Daddy! Daddy! Caesar! Oh wait, did it sneak into the girl's place and steal the bike? No! Don't 
doesn't matter with you. If I see that animal anywhere near my house or my kids again, it's not dangerous. It won't happen again. Damn right it won't. They don't know how. They don't know how it is, so they're just afraid. I was about to say, can they sense him in there? Mm -hmm. Don't worry. It'll be over soon and we can go get a treat. I'm thinking ice cream. <laughs> thinks that you and I should have dinner together. He's trying to help you get someone. Hell yeah. <laughs> Caesar, come on. Good to see you again, Caroline. <laughs> and it worked. She's there. My God. She doesn't need a leash. She'll be fine. Come on. Just be safe. Come on. Come on, Caesar. It's weird how she's tagging on now, but then, like I said, I don't see the mom, so what happened to the mom? What's this? What's he doing? I don't believe that. What? He's asking your permission. It's a supplicating gesture. Oh. Oh my god, I didn't think that would happen. Okay. So he keeps letting him do that, I'm, I'm guessing. Okay. It's been five years. <sighs> and they're still together. Dog kept barking, bro. Get your dog to shut up. He was perfectly fine. You okay, pal? Are you a pet? No. I didn't know that's what he asked. That is so sad. I'm your father. They need to put subtitles for the damn sign language, because I don't know sign language. He was given medicine. Like the medicine I give to Charles. She passed it on to you. That's why you're so smart. Did the girl not know that? Or maybe she didn't think he should know that? All right. I snuck him out of the lab to save his life. I had no idea that the effects had been transferred vertically from his mother. They've been together for five years and she didn't know this story. Are you okay? Yeah, fine. Oh wait, so his dad has been okay for five years. So it actually did work. Okay. The system has found a way to fight the 112 virus so that it can't deliver its therapy. My father's disease is going to return with a vengeance. So it's gonna return. So what do you do then? Just keep giving it to him? Oh well, wait, that's what he was saying earlier, right? He keeps giving him the medicine? Is he stealing someone's car? Stop! And that's the same neighbor from whatever would happen with Caesar. They just going through some shit with that neighbor. Wait, I have a car just up here. You know, wait, stop! Obviously, I'm done. I'm done. The police can handle it. Stay right there. 
You are going nowhere, Mr. You are the Oh, Caesar's about to do something. I was about to say, so his sickness did come back, which is what he was talking about. Okay. Right there. Oh shit. See, he means well because he's trying to protect the other dude, but Did he just take his finger? Uh. I didn't realize they took him away, but what do you expect when something like that happens? All right now, it's gonna be okay. Let's just see what it's like inside, okay? Come on, Susan. Just go. That kind of messed up like the whole thing because it's like how how is Caesar supposed to live with him now? Like I feel like he's not gonna be able to come out of there. So it's okay. Asking permission again. Oh, we're used to that. He'll be a little skittish at first, but we'll integrate him. You'd be surprised. Tom Felton? What the fuck? Caesar! It's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay. He's gonna start freaking out now. He's never been in a place like that. Coming back soon. I hate that he has to leave him. Like, he hasn't, that's all he's known his whole life is that dude and the other two. And now he's in a place he doesn't even know by himself. Well, not for long. Hey, down here. Damn, you trapped him in a cage. <laughs> monkey I thought he was gonna get to stay in that room not in a cage with like all the this is horrible all right, here's what's gonna happen you're gonna go back on your computer you know shift things around and you're gonna get me a date for my appeal this week you got it I can't help you why why does it have to be 90 days though 90 days is so freaking long that's literally three months my father's immune system continues to reject the 112 virus, rendering the gene therapy obsolete. His health is deteriorating. So it's no longer working for him. Okay. How many drugs have come down the pipeline that could save millions of lives? It could change everything. What are you talking about? The ALZ 112. Dude doesn't know that he took some and was doing and was using it on his dad ever going to get approved. The 112 is dangerous, Will, and it doesn't work. I treated my father with it. It does work. And now bro is shook. What, what are you saying? My father didn't just recover. He improved. You mean increased intelligence? So he improved in a way, but now his sickness is catching back up with him until the strain that he tests. Mm. Grade A primate. Go on. Don't you know food when you see it? I hate his character in this. Forget you, Tom Felton. I'll show you something funny. That is totally uncalled for. He just, it was just a little bit of food. Mm. 
What is it that he just drew? The window. Well. What else he wants? He's really calm. Yeah. Yeah, this guy's seen the inside of a whole lot of labs. He knows the drill. Franklin, get your mask on! Got it? Why did that dude have his mask off in the first place? I thought you were supposed to keep it on. Or, wait. Did I get knocked off? Is that the first time he's been put with them? Because they seem to have had him for a while now. They're gonna bully him for, like, being human-like. Why? Why are they all attacking him? The one thing you do that I like. Thanks, bro. I take it back. That's some bullshit. He didn't even do anything. He was just trying to protect himself. Or just run away. Intelligence results are remarkable. No adverse effects. Apes have amazingly strong immune systems. Yeah. So while they're working on this shit, mostly for her... Well, for his dad, he's actually helping the apes with all that shit. Unless... Excuse me a sec. Bro just sneezed blood on... What does that mean then? Is that... Tr is that ape gonna die? Even that one knows sign language too? Hey! Hey! Hey, <laughs> hey Jesus. I'm so happy he gets to see him. He's been through some shit. Right now. Not without a court order, you're not. He's not yours anymore. I promise. If I find out he's been mistreated in any way, Please shut down. Please do. Like, it's absurd, man. No. No, we're not going home right now. But I'm gonna get you out of here. I really hope one day he's able to take him home. Maybe Caesar is gonna end up getting pissed and then going after dude. He said fuck that wall, wall window, so now he's really hurt. How's that considered fun? You're just terrifying them. And you're letting other people in there while they're openly drinking? I knew it! So he did get it. I just know when he gets out. He is smart enough to do that. It's 
stand Caesar, man. Hell yeah, get out of that damn place. What about your buddy, though? Leave it for him, I guess. He's letting the big, big one out. Maybe he's just exploring because he hasn't been out. So he's made an alliance with the big and bad one. Hell yeah. But he's still in there? What do I feel like it's about he's about to die? He's gonna take over that place. No, and they're all gonna follow after him. Okay. I, I think that's what's gonna happen. He doesn't wanna do it anymore. Don't tell me his dad just died. Don't tell me he died during the night. No. Tell me you're lying. Works well. Tell him, Linda. For starters, Koba scored a perfect 15 on the Lucas Tower. Every test result verifies its effectiveness. No more tests. What are you So he was mad at first about wanting to do the tests that dude wanted to do. And then now that the one success is, he's like rushing with everything else. A drug that is worth more than everything else we are developing combined. You make history, I make money. Isn't that our arrangement? Of course, it's about the fucking money. I could finish your career with one phone call. I'll save you the trouble, I quit. We will proceed. Okay. Just quit. It's me, Franklin. I need to talk to you. Can you come to the door? <laughs> Bro is sick. Yeah. Wait, so that what's happening to him? He didn't have anything wrong with him, so... And like it got into a system. <coughs> and you just transferred it over to that dude. That neighbor goes through some stuff, bro. Well, I can't say I approve. They're not people, you know. You gonna let them go or not? For the right around amount of money, please. Let him go. Caesar. Hey, come on. He's mad at him. So now he's not going to want to leave. <laughs> he don't want to go with you no more. It's weird that he's staying for his friends, basically, but then it's like as soon as he looked at the leash thing, too, he didn't think that he'd have the type of freedom that he has there, even though it doesn't seem like he has much freedom. <laughs> mm. 
they all got cookies. Well, he's going to give them to them. It's wild that they do that while no one else knows. Did you leave the hose out in the atrium again? What? No! Did he remember the code? <laughs> no fucking way. How? Okay. That's amazing. Caesar can go anywhere he wants right now. He got out. He snuck out and went home. What is he- is he gonna use that on one of the other ones? He's not doing it for just one of his friends, but for fucking all of them! Why did I think of that? They're all just playing it cool while dude's there for them. Oh. All of their eyes are green, so that's how you know it works. I thought his eyes were green before. Imagine how creepy that is just to see them all like looking at you like that. <laughs> so that killed the dude, but they also just gave it to the. Well, Caesar just gave it to all of them. So does that mean it's only designed for. Apes, or maybe there really was something that was wrong with it. Rodney, get to the platform now. Was that not the dude that played the dad in the 100? Like Clark's dad? Go on, get! That's it. You! See? Caesar didn't even do anything to you. He was just standing there, bro. Take your stinking bar off me, you damn 38. No! Huh? You just spoke? Okay. And now he's the one locked up. I'm sorry, you treated them badly. It's kind of like, you deserve it. He gonna blast you now with the water, right? Oh shit. Wait, what happened to his friend? Like, the big one? I forgot his name. Did they take him? 
Wait, no, that's him right there. Then whose cage was he looking at? They are all out. My God. That is terrifying. Imagine looking up and seeing that. They all escaped, buddy, because of Caesar. He's smart. And I think Tom Felton's character is dead, so that's Caesar's first kill. Hopefully only. What happened? She spoke. Now he knows that Caesar spoke. He spoke. Oh God, wait, so what can they do? They can't get them back all in one place, like go after all of them. Tell me. What is it? No worries. They're going to the lab. Okay, they have reason to, and especially now that he knew he knows that's where his mom died. Franklin is dead from a viral infection. The hell are you talking about? He was exposed to the 113. It does something to people that it doesn't do to apes. So I was right. It was most. It's mostly made for apes. Well, just for apes, basically, not mostly. And is he gonna die? It's going to be so terrifying if he dies like that. I'm guessing he's dead because they just left the place. Or not, never mind. Okay, thanks for the help, buddy. Now, those are out too, and they haven't even been exposed to the 113 drug. Hell nah, bro. Okay, okay, get your friend back. It's wild that the freaking windshield caught that thing like that. I thought it would have went just straight through and killed them both, like both of those dudes. You're on the bridge. Do you think it's even gonna matter if dude shows up on the bridge? Like, he seemed mad at dude in the first place, so I don't think Caesar is gonna care if he sees the other dude that much. Okay, okay, what's gonna happen? Are they coming on horses? What the fuck are the horses gonna do? You're gonna get Caesar. If one of them end up dying, man. Ooh, she was the distraction. Oh, 
Oh, so no killing. Okay. What are you shooting at? All you're doing is shooting at the top of a bus. Hell yeah, ride the horse. What's gonna happen now? Oh no, 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 he's gonna get shot. No, don't tell me. That didn't work, buddy. He still came at you. He lasted that long, but it's gonna die anyway. Help me. Help me. You ain't getting help, bro. You about to get killed. He didn't kill you himself, he's just gonna let you stay there. Or just the other one go for him. He's not gonna talk to him? He knows that's the park he's gonna go to. Caesar's still protecting him. They're like the same height now, shit. Please come home. If you come home, I'll protect you. He's not gonna say anything? Sad, but it's also really cool that you talked like that. Caesar's home. Go. God, it's like literally I thought it's like at the beginning of the movie you would think that this movie was going by so quick because you know it's had like big time jumps it was like what eight years that like happened at the beginning and then it's like after all that they stayed like in present time and now all of like this shit is happening but then it's like if you think about it now you see how long it took that process to happen because Caesar was a part of like the original experiment in a way and then it took him eight years to develop into what he is now and to be able to speak and it's like you don't even know how quick this shit is to working and it's like yeah he he gave it to all his friends they're cool and mighty now but it's like 
when when are we gonna hear everyone else start speaking? Because he's the only one we heard. And just to think that he spoke, it's like their intelligence their intelligence increased so fast and it blows my mind. Like, he, w dude was just trying to help his dad with Alzheimer's and then it turned into this and now all the apes are like, well not all, they're just in one state, but it could be worldwide sometime soon or something, I don't know. There's two other movies, but like, it's sad that dude's dad died and he didn't even get to see Caesar again. I didn't even think about that till now. Because now Caesar is out and about. He can talk a little bit. And the dad didn't even get to see that. That is depressing. But I swear, I never expected that movie to be like that. I expect, like... I don't know why I expected kind of like a joking kind of movie, but it's like, it was way more than that. I didn't expect to like it as much as I did, like, shit, it really gets you to thinking about like the ape's intelligence, some kind of medicine that could be made like, it's making me think too hard right now. <laughs> Because it's like, imagine if this shit did happen. That would be terrifying. But also cool. Like, it all, I feel like, it mostly kind of boils down to the fear of that shit. Because some of this stuff would have happened if, like, fear wasn't involved. Like, anytime something with Caesar happened, like, before he went into the zoo and shit. Like, whenever he attacked the neighbor for, like, coming at dude's dad. It's like everyone was just scared of him and dude was just trying to protect oh dude you know like it's hard to explain but it just made me feel so bad because they don't understand because it's like they're both trying to understand the whole situation but it's just it's unusual for shit like that to happen <sighs> that movie was too good i would say i can give it we're gonna give it an 8 out of 10. I feel like there have been far better movies I've seen. And this is very considerate because I literally didn't think that I would like this movie as much as I did. So yeah, we're gonna go with 8 out of 10. Love this movie. I wonder if is James Franco gonna be in the next one? Because it's like... Are they ever going to see each other again? I hope they do. And I want to find that out. So I guess come back for the second one. <laughs>